the previous solar challenge, we sort of guessed what is the energy usage of our car. As far as the statistical part of, of what we've got, I think we know a, a lot more and therefore we can strategize better and we can use the energy much more efficient. So we've improved the amount of kilometers that we can do each day, I think by a lot of kilometers. So I think yeah, knowing what we've got and how to use that is the major part of, of where we've improved. The car has a six square meter array area for the solar panels. Um, we tried to change the fairings of the vehicle to make it more aerodynamic, as well as we had to look at the dome of the cockpit to ensure that there's enough space for the driver in case of any accidents. We have better batteries than we use in Australia, so it will be more efficient we have more power in them. And then the new battery monitoring system will be more efficient in terms of it will use um, less power to, to monitor the batteries so that we can have a real real time display of the batteries and don't use that much energy just for monitoring purposes. Currently we're using aluminium rims um, which is a bit heavier than the carbon fiber so um, we're hoping that the carbon fiber will definitely be lighter because one wheel weighs about 800 grams and then obviously with each five kilogram we spare on weight we get one percent um, more out of the solar panels so it, it'll definitely the lighter weight will make us go faster and the um, carbon fiber rims are all um, are bigger than the aluminium we have currently so it's also um, better for the car it's more stable uh, more balanced. So I've been working on the solar car and different aspects of it, um, design work mainly, and uh, updating a few uh, brackets. And uh, I didn't ex really expect this. I expected to do more theoretical work, which because that's what we're used to in the states. Um, so coming here and actually physically working on the car and actually seeing how the whole process in manufacturing works is actually mind blowing to me. I'm so excited every day to be part of this team. It's world-leading technology we're developing here, and I can be part of it. It means a lot. It means definitely a lot, because um, I'm a biomedical engineer, which is pretty much electrical engineering with a few science classes. So I've taught, I've got a lot, I've gained a lot of knowledge from these principles, and I can um, relate that back at home. And just saying that I've worked on a solar car is just life-changing, and it can definitely better me and, and my future, um, future wishes and anything I want to do.